Hey, let's go ahead and get to Radio Graffiti right now. Now, listen, all of you people that were pissing and moaning about how you you didn't have an early Radio Graffiti, you can thank all these dumb fucking dick snot loving pieces of nipple clamp loving butt plug up the ass looking migrant <laughs> mouth huggers that, that were out here that were talking shit about goddamn uh, uh, f- fucking rock ape. And I, I'm not going to take that, all right? I'm not going to just sit there and take that laying down, all right? Y'all got to be punished, all right? You got to be fucking punished. Son of a bitch. Anyway, if you want to, give us a call right now, 667-770-1015. And once the operator bitch starts talking, go ahead and push in the code 844286. And once you do, you will be in queue to be a part of Radio Graffiti. And when I call on your area code or on your name, you've got exactly four to five seconds to say whatever it is that's on your mind that's why we call this Radio Graffiti. Does everybody understand that? All right. Without any further ado, do we have any Radio Graffiti calls, engineer? No, no, no. All right. Well, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get to Radio Graffiti right now. All right. We're about to connect to the Radio Graffiti line. So let's go ahead and see what's on there. You're about to hear troll There are hell. 10 right. participants in the conference. All participants oh, are up. muted. Anyway, folks, I'm going to give you guys a little time because we only had 11 people that are in Radio Graffiti. So I'm going to give you guys a little time to call up. So, uh, you know, we have an abundant amount of callers to call up on. But I think everybody out there knows what time it is, right? It's time for more beer. That's what the fuck time it is. All right. So let's go ahead and open up a new beer. All right. There it is. Get that shit out of here. And then we're going to get to some goddamn Radio Graffiti here. Now, look. All right, I, I, I'm a little thin-skinned this evening, all right? Especially after y'all went after Rock Ape. I'm a little thin-skinned this evening, so I, I, I just would warn you, don't fuck with me is all I got to say, all right? Jesus Christ. You know, before I do that, let me get a fucking shot, all right? And guess what? I'm pulling out the big guns. You know what I'm talking about? I'm pulling out Johnny Walker Blue Label. Oh, yeah! All right, cheers to everybody out there. I, I'm sipping it right out of the bottle, baby, because I'm a I'm a gangster, baby. You know what I mean? Like Birdman style, right? Cheers to the Birdman. All right? I'm talking about the Birdman from the Cash Money Brothers. All right, give me a drink. All right? All right, now, here's to the wine. Here's to the glass. Here's to the woman with a big O ass. Cheers, baby, cheers. All right? All right. All right. Let's go ahead and get to Radio Graffiti right now. All right, let's go ahead and do it. We got, um, who do we got here? The Fifth Collective, Radio Graffiti. Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to Fifth Collective News Network. I'm Keith Rowford. We bring you an update tonight on the manhunt for Thomas Ghost Albin. New surveillance recordings have come up connecting ghosts to get another shooting at a Popeye's chicken restaurant, this time off of West Ben White Boulevard in Austin, Texas. The shooting began after Ghost engaged in a verbal altercation with a black female customer who witnesses say he cut in front of. We will now play a recording of this surveillance footage, but listener discretion is advised. Excuse me, sir, you just cut in front of me. I was next. This bitch is playing the innocent. Uh, I am not playing innocent. You did just cut in front of me. You know what? Fuck off. All right. Uh, you know what? Fuck you. All right. Excuse you. Look, I'm just trying to get some food for me and my kids, and you up in here cutting in front of people, cussing them off. You know what kind of man is you? Look, you want to take it outside, asshole? Oh, I will kick your white ass if you want it that way. Hey, will you better just go in front already? I sure as hell I'm not. Look out! He has a gun on him. You fucking stupid fucking pieces of shit! Everyone, get out! Run, run! You fucking piece of no, shit! Please, put the gun down! No, no! Ah! 
this point, the black customer takes out her own concealed weapon and attempts to subdue the gunman. Drop your gun, drop your fucking gun. How quaint this bitch has got a gun. I ain't asking again, you drop your gun right the fuck right fucking now. Let fuck you! <laughs> Ghost once again fled the crime scene in his signature electric wheelchair. In his wake, four people were left dead with three more seriously injured. It is important to note that this seems to predate Ghost traveling to the Middle East to help the terrorist organization Hamas. We'll keep you posted for any further uncovered shootings involving Ghost, as well as his terrorist involvement. You Reporting for 5th Collective Shut News up. Network, Shut I'm Keith Rowe. Shut him up! All right, the first fucking radio graffiti. Get this shit out of here. This fucking shit out of here. These fucking cans. This shit out of here. Fucking piece of shit, dude. All right, all right. Look, I'm gonna let that fucking shit slide. All right, because I'm fucking tired of this shit. I'm fucking tired of this crap. All right, is it good radio graffiti, all right? Is it good? Yes, kid. How good is that dick? Oh, oh. How good is that dick, bitch? Amazing. Amazing. Oh. <laughs> is it good? Yes, kid. How good is that dick? Oh, oh. How good is that dick, bitch? Amazing. Amazing. Oh. <laughs> is that dick good? Yes, kid. How good is that dick? Oh, oh. How good is that dick, bitch? Amazing. Amazing. Get the shit out of here, you fucking pervert! Shut shit! Fucking stupid fucking assholes, dude! Dude, look, y'all are starting to piss me off. Y'all are really starting to piss me off. Uh, uh, dude, cut the shit. Cut the shit! And who the fuck is this gravestone ape radio graffiti? You're not going to say anything? You're just going to have a little fucking gravestone? Yeah, that's what I figured. All right? That's what I figured. I hope you, you die of cancer of the cock, you stupid, dumb fucking piece of trash. All right, let's take some numbers here, all right? How about area code 413, Radio Graffiti? Mom and Dad don't like my whining, so they're going to get in trouble with the law if nobody likes my whining, okay? I love my mom and my dad. I'm not, I'm not being mean about mom and dad or anything. I just want them to do what I say because I am their leader. And you will call me leader, Joshua, from now on. Because oh, I am the leader of my good old mom and my good old dad. And if they don't like my whining, well, guess what? They're going to get in trouble with the police for not liking it. Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> All right, shut this shit up, for Christ's sake. Uh, who else do we have here? We got uh, area code 216, Radio Graffiti. That guy was so fucking annoying, just like you, Ghost. I fucking hate you. Well, I, I mean, you can hate me, but at least I don't sound like I just popped out of the anal passage of a fucking useless, glory you hole server. You are fucking useless. Oh, right? uh, yeah? Yeah. That's pro I mean, why don't you come up with a comeback, dude? Why don't you rip off a joke from jokes.com? Or, you know what? Ask fucking ChatGPT for a joke, you fucking lame, no personality, having fucking father, having fuck. Quick? Hold on, hold on. Let me do that real quick. Let me do that real quick. Hold on. All right. Now, you know what? We don't have time for your no personality, having ass. All right, get the hell out of here and come back when you have a damn joke. Uh, who else do we got? We got Captus. Well, hold on. Capitalist Martian, Radio Graffiti. How's it going, my bestie, who did awesome as Zorak from Space Ghost? Man, I've been gassing a lot lately. What? Excuse me. So, yeah. That's your book of Tony Jail. Oh, I just farted again. Excuse me. Good grief. What the hell? I think I had some for dinner where it just made me gassy. I just farted now. Excuse Wait a minute. Me. This is Martian girl? It's probably the cookies I ate. Shadow? She's out here farting on her live stream? I'm not afraid of shadow. No way. <laughs> oh, God. God. 
can <laughs> maybe be a bit like a female version of Nick Avocado for what? so much. Is this really Martian girl? This is what she's doing on her stream when we're raiding her, and then, you know, we're pissing her off because she doesn't have a chance to fart or something? I mean, for fuck's sake, dude. Oh, my God. What else can I... I don't even know what else to... I don't even know what else to say. All right. How about important news for ghosts? Radio Graffiti. Hello, ghost. I want to play a game. This is how Fox are local, by the way, just saying. Man, it's not even a game. I'm just straight up, like, demanding shit from you. Um, look, you have to do something about this fucking tooth, bro. Like, it's, like, what, like what, what is, like, two grand to you? Come on, man. Like, it's, like, like two grand to get, a, to get like, your best employee a new tooth. And, look, I've already talked to, I've already fucking talked to your executive producer, Froppy, and we both agree that the most right thing to do is just getting this fucking tooth dealt with because you know it's not going to grow back on its own let's just let's both be honest here for a few seconds and just and then just think well what, what, what are we achieving by getting foxo a new tooth well for starters you're, you're saving foxo's beautiful smile and you know you know why we want to save that right yeah you do um and I suppose the second reason is, uh, so like, I don't have to pay it because it technically isn't my responsibility since I did break it while on the job eating a burrito oh, in celebration. You know what, El Foxo, take your fucking tooth and shove it up your fucking ass, you fucking goddamn stupid fucking idiot! God damn it, I'm tough tired of you talking about your fucking tooth, dude! Every fucking time, dude. You've been talking about it for a fucking year and a half or two years or some shit. Going on two years this next fucking January. All right. Hold on. I think we got Maria. Maria. What's going on, Maria? Uh, hey, guys. What's going on? I just called to say fuck Bon Chat. <laughs> oh. That's she's, what I called for. She's doing a diss <laughs> to Von Chat. And look, you're going to rile them up in Von Chat, uh -huh, man. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And do you have anything to say to Haywood? Yeah, and you know, you know, well, I got a lot to say to Gaywood, that some bitch. Um, but, you know, you whored us out. What's up with that? I didn't you whore You are any... not our pimp. Yes, you did. I, I, look. You're pimping us, boss. <laughs> I'm not pimping anybody. They, look, they, they paid a lot of money. They want they want the damn D-Live removed. I don't know what it is. I mean, you didn't convince Haywood. You, you, you make, I'm going to have, come on now, dude. It's just not cool. Mom I'm, talks, I guess. I'm still monitoring the D Live and all the other chats, man. All right. I mean, it just so happens oh, it's you not. You barely see what we're saying. What That's are you talking a lot about? Of bullshit. All right, Maria. I don't like the way you get in the get in the kitchen and make me a sandwich. All right. You see, I'm doing another video because of Maria. All right. All right. It's one thing to call out Haywood, and it's another thing to call out the Vaughn chat. But for you to sit over here and try to step on my nuts, I mean, come on, Maria. Jesus Christ. Let me play one video because Maria, you know, she kind of chapped my ass, all right? And I don't like my ass being chapped, Maria. All right? I don't like it at all. I don't like it one bit. And before we get to more radio graffiti, I think everybody out there knows what time it is, right? It's time for more beer! <laughs> Oh, my God. All right. I'm telling you, dude. I, I might start doing that now and just throw it up on, I don't know, some fucking rumble or something just for the, you know. I, I don't fucking know. I don't know. That was that was funny. I used to do that just for fun. It wasn't even like, you know. I don't know. Just It was. <laughs> All right. We've got, uh, let's get some names here. How about Ghost Fauci, Radio Graffiti? Dr. Fauci, get us vaccine from some bum. Help no all the people who have been quarantined. Bum, 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 bum. We'll wear our masks and we'll have the status slim. Bum, bum, bum. We'll wash our hands and we'll be more resistant. Fauci, yes! 
promise is tweedum buzz bum bum will have a cure that can fight off this disease bum buzz bum can fill with with some ease dr fauci don't forget me <laughs> What a senseless waste of human life. You son of a bitch, dude. You see, I was in a good fucking mood. I was in a good fucking goddamn mood. I was in a good fucking mood. And then you had to fucking, you know, play some stupid shit like that. Yeah, that's great. Who the fuck just donated needs to pee, pick up? The fuck does that mean needs to pee? The fuck does that mean? I don't even see you on here. Where is it needs to pee? Where the fuck is needs to pee? There ain't nobody that needs to pee. Jesus Christ. All right, who else do we have? How about I just freaking said that, Radio Graffiti. More like Barry Blackberry over there putting a comment on a GL Joe and sitting on it while watching some fucking stupid... Oh, shut up. Shut the fuck up. There ain't no 111. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. There ain't no 111. There isn't 111. Shut up. Uh, how about 626, Radio Graffiti? Fuck the be like chat. Fuck them. Fuck them up her ass. Fuck them in his mouth. Fuck them in your pussy. Fuck them in your I got a report. She can eat my shit. Holy shit, dude. Hold on. Why the hell? Did you hear that? That was somebody, like, fucking saying, fuck the D-Live chat, and, and they were disrespecting Maria Maria, dude. Anyway, uh, let's continue here. Who else do we have? Uh, we've got, uh, how about 734 Radio Graffiti? I've known people who died of cancer, all right? You're breaking my heart. Don't leave me, please. Don't leave me. <laughs> You fucking piece of fuck. God damn it. God damn it. All right, all right, all right. We're going back to the videos, all right, you fucking piece of shit. I'm tired of you people thinking that making fun of somebody's death, all right, especially somebody from the inner circle is fucking comedy or something. It's funny. It's not fucking funny. It's not fucking funny. Listening to Pantera, Radio Graffiti. Hi, guys. Today we're going to be listening to Pantera until I get the urge to beat my wife up. Let's do this. One, two, three, four. One. All right, take this fucking idiot out of here. All right, first of all, fuck you. Secondly, that's a badass song. That's called fucking Hostile. All right, who else do we got here? How about, uh, how about Buttery Bungus, Radio Graffiti? All right, all right, all right. Uh, hold on, well, Ghost Needs to Know This, Radio Graffiti. Hey, Ghost, uh, Fox out again, and, um... Yeah, God, we got some more problems. Um, uh, Office Depot uh, figured out that you're not actually in a shack chair. Like, they figured out it's just some, like, $50 shit from Staples. No, like, it isn't. This is a problem. No, if it's not. Go, fuck problem. you, Alfoxo. Dude, I've got... The, dude, it's a piece of shit, the shack chair, dude. How much? I think I think I paid like five ninety nine for it. I figured, all right, well, if it can hold up a fat piece of shit like Shaq, it should hold me up. Dude, I bought this like t a year and a half, two years ago. This shit has fallen apart. I'm surprised I'm still even being held up by this fucking thing. Listen to this shit. Oh, it's, oh now it stopped squeaking? Oh, look at that. Now it's stopping squeaking. How fucking quaint. I'm sure fucking Shaq came in here and got one of his boys to come fucking oil this shit down or some shit. All right. Anyway, let's continue. How about 941, Radio Graffiti? Hey, Ghost. It's Winston Fujimori. What's going on, Winston? How are you doing? I, I can see you're enjoying all the anime that's being donated today. I'll be honest. 
Okay, I don't know if it's that, but this is one of the best ghost shows ever. I want to say, though, I'm completely stoned out of my mind right now. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, what are you smoking? You smoking dabs? You smoking regular herb? Or are you fucking, you know, eating edibles? What are you doing? Eating edibles. Ah, uh, so yeah, I can, I can probably, I can actually sense in your vocal vernacular that you are under the influence of some level of an intoxicant, you know? Hell yeah. Um, I wanted to say to Besmirch and Merch, that, that video you donated was really good. What? Besmirch the Merch, you're talking about the whammy? Yeah, well, well, that one too. He's been like throwing on some really good ones tonight. But I mean the esoteric one where, uh, I forget what happens, I think... It, there was a thing with Silent Hill, and it goes like backwards. It was really out of there. I think that might have been Horatio Nelson. I think I don't know. I'm not too sure. Oh, yeah, Horatio. All right, all good. Uh, by the way, Ghost. What's up? Um, not to bring inner circle stuff in here, but two things. Can you please get back to my friend who really wants to get into contact with you because he donated way back when to get into the IC, but didn't join on Discord. Dude, listen, I'm tired of you being a conduit to people that, like, you know, they left the community for, like, fucking 10 years, and then all of a sudden they realize the inner circle is some shit, and now all of a sudden they want to come back to the inner circle. I mean, do you think that's fucking fair? Well, I made a promise to them that if they, do, or a promise to you where if they were to join, they have to participate in both VC and in text for the remainder of the time in there. Oh, chief. You know what, Winston? Go fuck off, dude. All right, stop. Look, listen. I want people to stop going through Winston to get to me, all right? I get it. Winston is like an emotionally fucking sensitive fuck, and all you got to do is throw him some sob story, and he'll fucking believe you. I mean, give me a fucking break, all right? And by the way, uh, this this guy that he wants to bring back to the inner circle, he didn't pay 300 You know, the initial price for the inner circle back in 2016... I'd buy that for a dollar. The initial price was fucking 40 bucks. all right? And then I was like, holy shit, man, we got a lot of people, and I raised it to 50 because I, I was like, holy shit, then everybody wanted to be a part of it, and I was like, well, fuck! I'm going to raise it to 300 it's been 300 since, like, two... 2018? It's been, it's been fucking 2018, for Christ's sake. Anyway, uh, that was a long time ago, dude. It's going to be 2024, so I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Anyway, let's continue. We're going to do some more radio graffiti here. 734 radio graffiti. Time for snake ass. Yeah, that's not funny, the asshole. All right, fuck you. That's not funny. What is up with you fucking people with your obsession with a snake in the ass and black schlongs and eating shit? I mean, what the fuck is up with that shit? I mean, it doesn't dawn on you that you're, you're part of the problem, you know, if, if you're enjoying this, that there's something wrong with your head that you may be, you know, that this is actually, uh, and believe it or not, you can look this up, HIV infection. When you have HIV infection, uh, it fucks with your brain so much that you start getting infatuated with shit like scat and piss and all that. Cr I'm not fucking joking around. I'm not kidding. So, you know, it is what it is. All right, look, I'm supposed to pick up a restricted number here because they need to pee. All right, so restricted radio graffiti. Oh, finally. <laughs> Holy shit, you win. <laughs> You waited that long to take a piss? Oh, oh God. Oh, that's a bad prostate. Did you see that? It fucking stopped there for a second, and then this guy just went and just... No, I hit the fan. What? You hit the what? Oh, I hit the lid. I got a big cock. Oh, my God. Uh, is this anyway, is this proud oh, bad dragon? Who is this? No, I just got a big dick. And I took a piss on your show. Fuck you. That sounds like fucking Ice Poseidon. Is this fucking Ice Poseidon? Was that sounded like fucking Ice Poseidon? Did y'all hear that shit? That sounded like fucking Ice Poseidon for Christ's sake. And by the way, if it's Ice Poseidon, you you know. <laughs> I mean, no offense, dude. I mean, you know, you're, you're, you're given whatever you're given, but, bro, you don't have you don't have shit. I know you're not satisfying Kim Silla with that, dude. I'm just saying. But then again, 
Kim Silla is a little bit of a money, you know, person. She, you know, yeah, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Anyway, let's not get into that. That did sound like, I, yeah, yeah, dude, yeah, fuck it, dude. Fuck it, dude. I got the prison stream, dude. Fuck it, dude. Anyway, uh, anyway, let's continue. We've got uh, Helmet Boy's Retirement, Radio Graffiti. Look, this whole, like, writer Israel situation is kind of getting a bit out of hand there. I'm not happy about you doing this whole, like, anti-Semitic, like, anti-Israel character. I, I don't know what it is. I, like, they certainly didn't write it. Whoa, um, whoa, whoa, <laughs> hold on. First of all, I'm not anti-Israel. I'm not anti-Jew. All right, what I am, though, is what the government of Israel, which is led by Benjamin Netanyahu, which is, by the way, has so much clout within the government, he can get away with the shit that he got he gets away with, all right? And I don't agree with the type of response that they gave to the supposed Hamas attack, which, as I've stated on my website, Ghost Not Report, I allude to the fact that, you know, Israel may have just, you know, attacked itself. I'm just saying, all right? Anyway, let's get to uh, uh, Philip Babin, Radio Graffiti. Oh my God, All right, I don't know what the hell that was. And somebody said 90% of Biden's administration is Jewish. They're secular Jews, dude. These aren't Orthodox Jews. And by the way, did you see any rabbis or any Hasidic Jews being killed in the Hamas attack? No. And I don't think that's a coincidence. All right, just saying. Uh, Here's another Philip Babin, Radio Graffiti. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Am I on? Yeah, what's up, man? Oh, how's it going, man? How you doing? I haven't watched your show in, like, forever. Hey, cheers, man. I appreciate it. What's going on with you this uh, uh, early morning? Oh, it's Wild Randy. Hey, oh, by the way... Uh, all I'm- right, I don't want to fucking hear this stupid dumb tard. Uh, all right, who else do we got here? Uh, you know, since we're going to talk about tards, we might as well bring in Barry Blackberry, since we're in the tard uh, portion of the broadcast. Barry Blackberry, Radio Graffiti. Hey, girls, how's how it's going? It's not going too bad, all right? Now, look, Barry Blackberry, I think you're a tard. I think you're fucking stupid. But I, I, there's a lot of people who like you in the Thunderdome. They wanted you back in the Thunderdome, and I'm glad you're back in. We, I had re-invited you, and I'm glad you're back in, all right? Thank you, thank you. But also... Save the TCR stuff for TCR. If yeah, you of, do course, TCR. Yeah, of course. You don't want to hear anything that will enlighten you because you're a fucking tard, all right? Shut up! All right, let's continue. We got Benjamin Netton Blue Blah Blue, Radio Graffiti. Yes, I've been talking to the show's writers. I've been talking to the writing department, and they've been just a little, uh, a little bit uh, about the whole, uh, you know, you hating Israel thing. Um... You know how Jewish writers get, right? All right, you know, I get it, El Foxo, that you really like this fucking, like, jigsaw voice, but come on, Maine, all right? All right, who else do we got? We got 661, Radio Graffiti. Oh, Prince, it's Ghosty. How you doing, man? Hey, what's up, man? Yeah, just um, just slamming him back, you know. It's, uh, it's a Wednesday night over here. We just had a public holiday. Um, how, how you doing? How, how's your week been going? Uh, it was going great until I did this fucking show, I'll tell you that. But since you're drinking, Prince, <laughs> you know what I mean? I think it's time for more beer! That's what I fucking think it's time Yeah, you're to... goddamn right, dude. Yeah, man. So what's hey, going on uh... with you, man? I, I, I haven't seen you too much in the IC or anything. I hope everything's going good with you, dude. Yeah, you know, just busy as usual. Um, yeah, we're, uh, we're, we're chugging tonight. It's just me, me and the dog. Um... Uh, did did you play my anime at the start of the show, by the way? Play your anime? What are you talking about, play your anime? Dude, that the video you finished the last show on, you rage quit like a third of the way through it. Uh, Don't you remember? Uh, you know what, I, I, fuck off, alright? We played your fucking anime, Prince, alright? We do a lot of shit for you, Prince, alright? We acknowledge you a lot in this fucking broadcast, Prince, even though you're saying death to America and all this other fucking wicked-ass crap, alright? 
All right, look, as you can see, I'm getting a little fucking, uh, a, a little buzz, you know, and, and, and much like Haywood would say, uh, ghost, you know, you, you get a little mean, you know, when you get drunk, you know what I mean? You get a little mean. I used to not get mean, all right? I used to not get mean. I used to actually be a very fucking nice and, and very funny, you know, alcohol, uh, alcoholic beverage consumer. And it was because of you people that now I'm starting to turn mean. I'll, I'll be honest with you. Now... Now I'm starting to turn mean. 